Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcome you to episode 17 of Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. And I'm starting on top of the apartment complex here, because we actually have a few things to do here. Um, yeah, between recordings I actually looked into this. I know, me doing like, research before recording? What is this madness? Oh yeah, I just didn't want to have to like, walk around like looking at stuff like, Oh, can I do this, or can I do that, or whatever. Didn't want to do that at the very beginning of the episode like a jackass. Alright, so we don't have any of this other furniture, like this jellyfish looking thing, or this toque looking thing, or this Satella view thing. So we can't really do anything there. And judging by like the silhouettes of like the future furniture that we're gonna get, I looked at that too. And it seems we're not gonna get any of those for quite some time, actually, so. Oh, we won't be we won't be like completely decorating either of these apartments fully until much later. I don't think I've like even in my own file that I played a while ago. I haven't finished those apartments, and I'm pretty far into the game on that one. Anyways, we also have a hide and seek stage to do here that I could have sworn I've already done. Maybe it just didn't take or something, I don't know, but we have a hide and seek stage in Melody Town to do. Oh, on second thought, maybe we didn't do this. I think it might have been a failed recording or something. Don't want to talk about that too much, but... Oh well. Right. Wow. <laughs> Right off the bat, I see two just sitting there. They just like blinked into existence from out of nowhere. That was random. Alright, oh crap, oh my god, I don't have much time for this at all now, do I? Oh, I never thought I'd see the day when there's like a hide and Zeke stage where it's like <laughs> very little time. I just hit my microphone. I swear I've done that like so much lately, I just hit my microphone. I went to scratch my chin just now. I hit my microphone, and my chin's still itchy, so... <laughs> Oh, nothing was accomplished except a bit of torture to your ears, unless I cut that sound out. If I can cut that sound out, because you never know with those things. Alright, so there's one up there. I think that's the one I missed last time. And this? And this? Yeah, we only have 20 seconds for this. This is crazy. And then you? I, I said you? Okay. And finally, you. I have to do the up thrust there to get you. At least up thrust is a lot easier to use than that freaking up thrust in Zelda too. All right, and I th I'm pretty sure that's the last hide and seek stage uh, that we have unlocked for now. Oh, let's see what kind of nifty fabric. Ew, well, it's kind of artistic, I guess. The music lover fabric. Oh well, I don't know. Sometimes the music isn't all about like the notes, the black and white notes, man. So maybe that's not for the music lover. Because, like, I would imagine, like, a music, lover, a music lover fabric would just, like, exemplify the creativity in the music, not, like, the physical notes there. So it would be, like, an explosion of color or something. But then I guess that could be any kind of artistic expression. Alright, mushroom run carry thing. So let's do this. Mushroom run carry fuck. Oh, boy. So today is August 3rd. And I was just out for a walk, actually. I haven't gone for, like, just just some normal walk in a very long time. Oh, it's kind of... kind of felt a little bit weird. And just... just my luck, you know? Like, when I go for a walk, it's all nice, and I'm just... I, it was just a short walk, like, maybe, like, just five minutes or so. Okay, I can't get up there, can I? No, but I can throw Carrie up there. Maybe. Uh, maybe... maybe not. Dude, get back here. Yeah, but I was only out there for like five minutes, and then like all of a sudden it just starts raining out of nowhere. And then I look up in the sky, and it's like the scariest thing I've ever seen. Like the sky legitimately looked evil. Like you know in video games how it's like cliched how whenever something evil is about to go ha is about to happen. Wow, these things can actually pick up carry. I just saw that freaking bird try to pick up carry. Yeah, but when something evil is about to happen, there's a bunch of like black clouds in the sky and they all start to like swirl together into some kind of vortex. It looked exactly like that in the sky today. It was just so scary. It's a it's a little bit more clear now, but still it's just like ooh chill just right. Oh what? Oh the throne's over there. The throne's over there. Okay. Oh, if I play my cards right here I might still be able to get there. A very slim chance, but it's possible. Alright. That's what I have to do. Wait, where'd she go? Where, where's Carrie? Is she down? Did she fall down here? Oh my god. Get up there. Get up there, you asshole. No. What? Okay. Ah, yes, okay. <laughs> oh my god. 
That was way too close. Oh, that congrats message covers up the time, so I don't know how much I had left there, but... Oh, I can always look at that in editing, I guess. Oh, another stage! Awesome! We should be, like, right at the end of this. We should just have, like, one or two more carry stages to go here. Hopefully, anyways. Because I want to move on to, the, like, other levels and stuff, you know? Actual levels. The mush. Did I say the mushroom soil fabric or the mushroom roll fabric? I wonder what a mushroom roll would taste like. Mm, there's egg rolls and, like, uh, spring rolls. What about a mushroom roll? Or a fuma roll? Fuma roll? I'm not sure. Okay, get carried to this spot. So it looks like we're gonna have to go up from here, just like we did for the Zeke thing. Let's go up, up, and away! Okay, let's see here. Now, what are you doing, crazy person? Oh, looks like we have to go over here. And, oh, I think we have to throw her onto that drum. Then we work our way onto that drum. You, oh, did she fall off? Tell me she didn't fall off. I'm just gonna take it and and hope that she didn't. Oh, oh my god, <laughs> that is way too close for my taste. What? Oh, okay. Oh, I thought I was gonna have to swing across there or something. Looks like I still will have to, but whatever. So let's clear this. I'm gonna get that out of the way too, just in case. Wait, there's nothing even up here. What? So I had to just clear that out for no reason. That was a total waste of like 15 seconds. Oh, that's just great. All right, let's go. Come on. Crap. Stay out of here. Stay out of here. No, Carrie. Oh my god. And then I fell too. I fell too. That was just great. Okay, well I'm screwed here now. Oh well. At least I know where to go now, man, and how to do it. Because I spent, like, a good 30 seconds there just wasting time, figuring, oh, where am I supposed to go? Because I just thought you had to go straight up from there. I didn't realize you had to go, like, far to the left and then up. Mm. Oh, well. Oh. Well. Oh, I just gotta take it day by day, you know? I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Take it day by day. That's in some kind of song, I'm not sure. Does anyone rem remember a song like that that has those lyrics in it? The, like, take it day by day? Mm. Alright. Let's see if we can do this right this time. We gotta throw her onto the drum, but you gotta be further back, like here. Like, in, if you line up with the arrow, maybe? Okay, no. <laughs> well, well she, she did get, like, over there, didn't she? Yeah, she got like way over here okay you know what am i doing i could just like stand on the drum and put her down <laughs> what the hell am i thinking oh my god i'm crazy all right get up there crap okay so we've got to do something like this and no not like that okay i gotta time time this just right why wouldn't you put her down kirby you crazy fool you are so dumb sometimes kirby Alright, so put her down, then go over here, wait for this thing to go down, pull this, get on top. Now I'm just saying what I'm doing, That's, that, that doesn't make for any entertaining video. Okay. Oh, cut that one close too. Both of these carry stages that I've done, I've cut close right at the end, just like one or two seconds left at the end. Thank you, no more carry stages, awesome. I was about sick of those, you know? I've been doing those for like the past three videos now, so... Time to move on to something more interesting. Something more interesting, like a fiery, fiery area, perhaps? Actually, no. We're already past the fire world or the hot world. I think that's what it's called, hot land. Hot wheels, eat that! Okay, let's see. Uh, no, I don't want to go to Waterland, Waterland yet. Well, actually, I do, because Waterland is kind of fun. But we have some more, like, of, we have, like, hidden levels to clear up in this toy, tr in the treat land now. Dude, I can't get the names of any of these places right. Like, Hot World and the uh, Water something. Water World. That's a movie. Never even saw it. I've heard it's really bad, though. Can, you, can anyone testify to that? Mm, I know it's also a game. Part of, like, that Sword Quest series or something. 
Oh, but that was before my time, so I don't know much about that. The most I know about that is from the, like, the angry Nintendo nerd, so. Alright, what's the controls again? I think it's like, yeah, okay, so that's a U-turn, and this is the tracks. Oh, that's good. Yep, so we got another train level here, folks. So this is going to be fun! Actually, no. It's not very fun. At least the sound effects are cool. Okay, t no. I want to hit that thing. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going to have to go around and then back up. So I can get that. Thank you. Whoa! There's a plane in the sky! Where did that come from? Can I catch up to it? It almost looks like I can't. Come on, I gotta be able to catch that plane. Oh god, it's disappearing. Okay. Oh, it disappeared. Well, that sucked. Alright, no, don't turn around. Alright, let's see here. Oh, I don't even need the train tracks for this, do I? Well, maybe I do. Maybe I was, like, still guiding it there. I don't know. This is a weird level, I tell you. Just all trains. Okay, wait, what? How do I get through there? Do I have to actually, like, hit that or something? Do I, like, run over this or something? I'm not sure. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's how you do it. Oh, but no in this game. This is probably on a timer or something. Oh, well, doesn't matter. Wait, what are you doing? Kirby? You dumbass. We got the Choco, Choco Auto Man. This, is, it, is it Auto Man or Auto Man? Whatever. This Auto Man is great, but what's it filled with? Oh, I hope it's filled with, like, marshmallows. I like marshmallow fluff. That shit's good. Mm. Oh. Somet I've never like really told anyone this, but sometimes in the middle of the night, I just like go out or like go upstairs and like I take some marshmallows and I just shove them in the microwave and just <laughs> and I just put I only put them in there for like 30 seconds, but it's enough to like melt them and turn them into like some kind of gooey marshmallow thing. And it's just so good, man. Oh my god. It's absolutely delicious. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we get this. And that should allow me to get that. Awesome. This and that. Jeez, if someone's blind and watching this, then I feel bad for them. Alright, so that's gonna undo that. And that's gonna open that one up there, I assume. Which means that I'm gonna have to go up here, turn around, and do that. Okay, that wasn't so bad, I guess. Oh, I, for some reason, I imagine that would be a lot worse than it was. We got the chocolate bar. This floor mat makes me wonder why there aren't more giant chocolate bars. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm. Well, aren't people, like, fat enough nowadays already? We don't need any giant chocolate bars. Seriously. Okay. So I want to get this. Get the beads, you know. Gotta collect them beads. And then we move up here. Alright, is there any way to just, like, make the tr make it drop? Okay, well, that works, I guess. Oh, I guess you just hit a wall or go off the end of the rack. Of the of the rack, yes. Off the, it's off the end of the rack. Off the end of the tracks. Don't drive on the railroad tracks! Unless you're a train. Okay, how am I gonna do this? Because there's, like, a thing back here. Is there a lever somewhere nearby? Or do I have to do something else to open that? Oh, you know what I bet I have to do? I bet... I bet that... Because there's just, like, six orange blocks up there. And I bet I have to do this. Charge right up through them. There's going to be a lever in here or something. Yeah, sure enough. I knew that... I knew that's what it was. I'm so smart. I'm so observant. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm observant in video games. That's about it. Alright, ooh, a Ferris wheel. Can I, like, go in a circle? Oh my god. Well, not if you're doing that. Oh my god, this is crazy. Look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my god. Okay. Oh yeah, the bad thing about going in a circle, I guess, is that it's like you can't, like, fall off very easily, so... There is that. Alright, I assume I don't want to hit that, or maybe I do, I'm not sure. All I know is that I got that patch. I don't know, why would that be there if I didn't want to hit it? Maybe I already hit it? I'm 
I'm talking about that thing that's attached to the green string, by the way. <laughs> Don't know if that was obvious or not. Pretty sure it was. Mm, but the way is open, so I might as well take it. Oh, a train down there now. Awesome. Oh, I preferred the plane myself, but... Man, this level is so hard to commentate over, I tell ya. I don't know, something about this train is just, it's so slow going. I bust right through there, yeah. And drop and bust through, yes. Alright, I'm still looking for that music disc, I know that much. I half expected the music disc to just like come on the screen the minute I said that. You never know. You never know about these things. Alright, I fell off there. I didn't realize that I'd stop drawing tracks. Alright, wow, I'm going it's going crazy fast. Okay. Oh, I got the music. Okay, Hotland me <laughs> What's with all these random, like, just level tracks or like world tracks being found in these levels? I don't know, but we got to the end of the world, so hallelujah to that. Time for the end of this boring ass commentary. I tell ya, I was listening to myself and just like, uh, 16 minutes? What? Oh my god, I'm not to 16 minutes. Dude, no way. 16 and a half minutes. Jeez. What? I didn't get gold. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't get gold. Look how close that is, though. I got silver. I found the chocolate patch, but I want gold. Oh my goodness. Now I have to go back and get gold, because I'm a completionist like that. Well, I'll probably do that between videos. And for now, we'll just see what this does. It has some chalk. Oh, what? Oh, that's scary. Big chocolate bat on top of big chocolate swooper. Dark manor. Oh my god. <laughs> that's gonna be a fun level. Yeah. So, but until next time, thanks everyone for watching. This is Argo Matrix, signing out. Thank you, and good night.